I'm really excited about the occasion, why we get to come together, uh, and that's to celebrate getting a VPP star status uh, here in Indiana. That's, it's just great, a great achievement. And thank you for everybody uh, for the role that you've played. Those here in the office, the teams, and, and the small things that we did every day uh, for our management, thank you for your support in, in getting this. It, it takes that kind of support to get an achievement like this. Uh, we even had people from pipeline and from terminals that let us come on your sites and show off how we lead projects. So thank you for, for allowing us to do that. What strikes me the most is that we really didn't have to do anything different than we do it every day. I mean, not to take away from the effort because it was a huge effort that Sheree put together to try to showcase how we do what we do every day. It's just part of our culture. And that was the best part about receiving this award in this day today. So thank you for that. Please continue the effort. I think one of the reasons we're standing here today, in my estimation, is a decision we made shortly after the joint venture, uh, Marathon and Ashen, was put together in 1998, which was to become a responsible care company. And uh, the decision to, to embrace responsible care is uh, the foundation for our commitment on how we conduct ourselves in, in the area of health environment, or health and safety, environmental stewardship, product stewardship, honesty and integrity. Uh, corporate citizenship and diversity and inclusion, the principles of responsible care that really shaped who we are today. And we also have a very strong relationship with the regulatory community and the many markets in which we do business. And uh, I believe we've, we've gained a great deal of credibility because of our embracement of responsible care in the way we do operate. From our customer standpoint, you know, when they come to a marathon asset, uh, one of the things we're extraordinarily proud of is the fact that we know they're coming to the best-in-class assets in the industry. They are going to be safe, clean, well-run, you know, uh, rules that need to be followed, but um, very important to, to, their, to their safety. And um, they also know that when they deal with our marketing folks, that they're going to be dealt with with people that have uh, very high ethics, uh, tremendous um, honesty and integrity. So I feel very good about being a responsible care company as the leader of the marketing organization and, and how our customers view us as a, uh, as a company. One of the things I'm most proud of and one of the key aspects about what we've achieved so far is that this was a brand and m and effort. And in, in my mind, that, that just exemplifies the values and the character of MPC. You know, we work together. If there's, uh, if there's something going on in, in, our, in our company, we pull up our bootstraps and we all work together on it. And we, we can achieve it, and we can achieve every, anything when we do that. But I, w I really want to recognize both uh, John Rice and Matt Heft in, the, in their leadership on this. So thank you. I'm here today to welcome you to the family. And uh, what's the family mean, okay? It's something I think we're trying to build here in Indiana. Uh, first of all, here's what the family is. Right now in Indiana, uh, and, and I want to tell you, you, you folks, in addition to us, are getting some recognition outside of the state for what we're doing here. Uh, as a matter of fact, uh, some places in the nation that are looking at Indiana, they're starting to call this the Indiana model because we're taking this program and leveraging it and moving it beyond much what m far beyond what some of the other states are doing okay we're really leveraging the program right now we have 70 sites in indiana so y you are one of 70 you are you know you think about all of the thousands of workplaces we have in the state of indiana and you're one of the 70 companies that has achieved this award that has this accomplishment now uh, nationally there's a little less than 2500 vpp sites so you're breathing some rarefied air not everybody gets this award, and it's not meant for everybody. On behalf of Governor Pence and Commissioner Rubin and the whole 100 hardworking people in the Department of Labor, I present you this VPP star plaque. Congratulations. <laughs>